right, Mark, thank you. And this shooting is hitting hard for the entire city of Colorado Springs. And now the friends and family of the two women and young men killed, they are struggling the hardest to come to grips with what happened. We continue our team coverage with Denver 7's Russell Haythorn. And Russell family members say the pain is just unbearable. And the enormity of the loss here in Colorado Springs is certainly starting to set in for this community and those family members. We have some photos of the victims to show you. Christy Galella was a 33-year-old who had recently lost 280 pounds, down to 120 from 400 at one time. She was planning to spend Halloween with her sister, Megan, on the far left of this photo, and her mom, who is in the middle. Christy and another woman were shot and killed in the front yard of this home on Platte Avenue early Early Saturday morning, today Christie's family gathered to remember her. She could look at you and know if something was wrong. She's amazing. She's an amazing person. I'll say this about her. She had a huge spirit. When my dad was seriously ill and was in a skilled nursing facility, she was there every day, no matter what. Brought him candy, took care of him. A second victim in front of that same home on Platte Avenue was Jennifer Vasquez, who was a mother, an aunt, and a sister. In fact, one of her cousins just stopped a moment ago to talk to us, and her cousin says Jennifer lost two of her brothers this past summer. Obviously, that family dealing with an incomprehensible amount of grief. Live in Colorado Springs, Russell Haythorn, Denver 7. Yeah, what a tragedy. Thank you, Russell.